Hello YouTube. The weather is actually decent today, so I figured I'd make my video response for Joe 600 sub contest now. I'm still in the park of the Karlsruhe Palace in Germany, where I met with some friends earlier to hang out and play some ping pong. And I'm going to show you the palace in a few minutes when I'm done with the video, um, because there are a lot of people walking around here and I'm way out of my comfort zone. Actually, but Joe requested it to uh, go outside and show some impressions of uh, where I live. Um, and it's actually it's 10 minutes from my house, so it's, it's a really nice place, but um, it's so crowded today. Um, today was the last day of school for uh, Abitur. That's like um, the high school seniors, so last day of school, they're done, they're going off to college in the fall. And they're partying here in the park. Um, so I want to make this video short. I'll start with my first pipe story. I have, it, mm, well, actually three pipe stories. Um, you should know I was a cigarette smoker for a long time, but I was able to quit a while ago. But um, to tell you all that, it would make the video at least 10 minutes longer. That's a story for another day. Right now, I'm smoking Fire Dance Flake. And I have to relight. It's a great smoke. I like it a lot. And this is actually um, the first pipe I purchased. It's a uh, half bent billiard briar. Um, I don't know the terms by heart, all of them. This is where my notes flying away. Um, I got this pipe of eBay for about thirty-five dollars, and the quality is amazing. I'm just, I, I, I feel so lucky to have found a pipe for for this price and this quality. Um, I've enjoyed a lot of smokes in there, and I still am. There's so many people walking around here. Um, animals. Um, I want. I someday want to own a stubby poker, though. So, um, much like the, I believe it was the Sleepy Hollow, you did, Joe, and uh, the Dagner Slayer. Those, those are my Grail pipes. I, I'm really looking forward to owning one of those someday soon. So I'm, I'm putting away some money and I know you have a big list, about 25 people or even more, so I don't expect <laughs> to get a pipe this year, but I want to make it on the list this year. I really do. So um, The first pipe tobacco um, I purchased wasn't the first I smoked. I got um, this downhill nightcap at my local tobacconist since uh, the selection was really limited and downhill was the only one I remembered from my research on YouTube and whatnot. Um, I just got that. It's a great English, don't get me wrong, but I think it's just too bold and spicy for a first pipe tobacco. It's just my opinion. I would have preferred something smoother and, uh, and aromatic. Maybe vanilla. I have a lot of tobaccos right now at home, um, three vanilla blends and two of them are, they are just amazing, you, you, you just want to smoke them all day long, just, that's just how good they are. Um, where was I? Okay, yeah, um, the first tobacco I smoked in this pipe wasn't Dunhill Nightcap. It was this tobacco. It's a mystery tobacco because I don't know what it is. It um, smells like um, fruitcake, so I guess it's some kind of... Mm, maybe, yeah, it's an aromatic with exotic fruit flavor or something like that. 
I don't like it. it. Smokes really hard and burns down like your mother. It it's just it's a 10 minute smoke. It's it's horrible. That was my first um, tobacco in my first um, purchase pipe. No. But I've smoked a lot in my day and I have actually tried a real pipe once before. It was about five years ago and I was with a friend at this guy's house um, late at night because we had to finish a paper for school. And um, when we were finished, we listened to some jazz and fired up his dad's pipe with some cognac tobacco. It was horrible. We were all cigarette smokers back then. Sorry, take a sip. So we were all cigarette smokers back then. So it's no su uh, to no surprise that we inhaled and we smoked much too fast. It wasn't enjoyable at all. Um, because the bowl got so hot we couldn't even hold it anymore. It was horrible. But we were younger and felt really cool and sophisticated smoking a pipe, listening to jazz and just chilling out like grown-ups. So, I hope I bored you with the stories. I plan on doing more videos in the future, pipe related and knife related, so if you're into it, you can subscribe, I would certainly be excited about that, and um, I'm gonna have a lot more stories in the future. Um, the pipe community on YouTube is really, really cool and I'm proud to be a part of it now. Thanks again, Joe, for this contest. YouTubers, I'll see you soon. I'm going to show you the um, palace real quick now. The camera sucks, but I think you saw it. Bye.